The Chinese Pakistani JF-17 Thunder! Come on, do the sound effect thing. I'm, I'm trying! No, oh, there it goes. Great timing there. You're like four seconds off. Maybe it was four miles away! The JF-17 Thunder is a multi-role, light attack, Chinese clone, Pakistani produced, how bad can it be, fourth generation fighter jet! That's right! The JF-17 was first designed by the Russians decades ago as the MiG-21 Fishbed. The famous Fishbed worked great! As F-15 bait, <laughs> F-15 shot them down like real easy. How easy? Like fish in a bucket easy. So what the really good at math Chinese did was take that MiG-21 fish bucket and transform it into a kind of a better fighter. But not really. Yeah, they basically just put a bigger F-16 looking wing on it rather than a short sucky fish fin wing. And this works great. F-15 pilots reported that it was almost a challenge to shoot these things down. The problem was, it seemed like a good idea at the time air and take on the nose was giving them a way on radar. So the Chinese busted out their abacuses and went back to work. This time they were determined to really make this Chinese Russian plane look more like an F-16. Totally a coincidence of course. Of course! The result of their hard work was the JF-17 Thunder! Now China made a deal with Pakistan and they make these things there too. Oh, good! Yeah, why spend 200 million dollars on a glitchy fifth generation fighter jet when you can spend a fraction of that and get a few of these? And who cares if they shoot them down? They make them in Pakistan, so you could just order more on the internet with a stolen credit card. Great advice there, kids. But it's not all good. Americans can still find a reason to be scared. What this time? The JF-17 is fitted with the new Chinese anti-ship ballistic missile. Uh-oh, somebody called ARPA. This high-tech death deadly missile was specifically designed by the Chinese to take out the U.S. aircraft carriers. Wait, wait, what? Are you serious? The U.S. just came up with a plan to stop these Chinese anti-ship ballistic missiles. Oh, thank God! Yeah, they're gonna call Aquaman for this one. What? He's not even real! I know, but the report says that they're gonna send Jason Momoa to talk to the Pakistani military and ask that they don't shoot our ships out of the water, like fish in a bucket. So it's like a diplomatic move? Yeah. I guess. And they're sending the actor who plays Aquaman? Looks like it. Huh. Okay. Has the U.S. Navy finally met its match with this 1950s Russian fishbed Chinese F-16 body kit modified Pakistani produced anti-ship ballistic missile firing Thundercat JF-17? Or is the U.S. going to once again gain the upper hand by calling in the guy who plays Aquaman to put a little diplomatic pressure on those Chinese Pakistanis? Your ships get too close to our country! I know, right? Freedom or something. How about you go away? How about you bow to the Aquaman? <laughs> you decide!